Hello and welcome back to the channel. Today's video is about a Mr. Fusion that was 3D printed from these files on Thingiverse. Um, I've put the link in the description if you want to have a look at the files. It's quite a nice model and all goes together well. I replaced the printer the other day and wanted the, uh, wanted the model to uh, give it a test run and Mr. Fusion seemed like the way to go. The print is a uh, 250mm build space so uh, Mr. Fusion sort of fits on there. The top section can be printed in one piece or two. Now I had to print it in two. Um, I end up printing the whole thing at 80% uh, in ABS filament uh, except for the clear which was PETG. I cleaned up the top piece, top section and um, but the rest was just painted as it come off the printer and then give it a couple coats of clear just to make it shine a little bit more. During the research phase of the project I uh, found out that the uh, original Mr. Fusion was actually a uh, Crump's coffee grinder that they just uh, put the Mr. Fusion badging on there. I found that interesting. Um, Here's uh, some of the detachable parts. So that's the, I guess that's the coffee grinds catcher. So this is it printed in uh, PG clear. It's always a bit disappointing how clear clear isn't. Um, I tried a couple settings that were on uh, printables, but it still didn't come out very clear. Um, so the Mr. Fusion hinges on this uh, latch. Uh, and um, there's an 8mm bolt that does all the hinging. Um, the original files, because these are 80%, the original files um, use a 10mm bolt or 3 8 uh, A couple of calibration bananas in there just to uh, for size, or maybe it's the actually fuel up the misfusion. I've uh, put some fly screen in there just to hide the um, ordinary overhang that was there on the printing. The original didn't have that, but uh, I thought I'd do that just to hide it. <laughs> Otherwise, I'd have to clean it up too much. So, a short video today, but uh, thank you for watching, and we'll catch you next time around. 